Good morning, here is Spectrum TV News Brief at this hour. I am Uyai Anyakan. First in our news today, the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Abubakar Malami, has refuted media reports that his office has exonerated Abakiari. The clarification was made in a statement issued by the Special Assistant on Media and Public Relations, Office of the Attorney General of the Federation, Omar Gwandu. In another development, the federal government is assuring Nigerians that the Lekki Deep Sea port in Lagos State will begin full commercial activities in September. Minister of Transportation Ruti Miyamichi, while inspecting the project in Lagos, described it as a huge achievement for the Buhari-led administration. In education, President Muhammad Buhari has extolled the West African Examinations Council, WAYEK, on the occasion of its 70th anniversary. This is as WAYEK will be holding its 70th annual council meeting in Abuja from today till Friday. Meanwhile, Vice President Yemio Sibajo has described President Muhammad Buhari as a model leader who respects other people's beliefs. Osibajo was visited by the Senegal-based Grand Kafila of Tijania movement worldwide, Sheikh Muhammadu Nayas, at the presidential villa said he had not had any disputes with the president since they took over power in 2015. Away from that, the Federal Ministry of Education says it will not enter into any agreements with the Academic Staff Union of Universities under duress. The ministry spokesman, Ben Gong, called on ASU to call off its strike so as not to pressurize the government into making promises it could not fulfill. On the foreign scene, Ukraine has announced that about 30 Russian missiles were fired at a military training base near the border of NATO member Poland. Officials say at least 35 people were killed and 134 others injured in the attack on the Yakrov base, which is used for training with NATO instructors. In sports, Barcelona women's team has won the Primera Division by trashing Real Madrid five goals to nothing to be crowned champions for a third season in a row. Barca's victory sent them 22 points clear at the top of the table with six games left to play. Details of this and more in our news at 12. I am Uyai Anyakan.